so we've just arrived outside the studio that I'm hiring from a lady called Chi and I've got my pattern I've got my fabric and we're gonna go up and I'm gonna sew the clo bias skirt because I'm confident that I can sew that in the time frame that I've hired the studio for we've got Got an overlocker and a Juki industrial machine. And all the scissors and bits. Extra threads for the overlocker. Cameraman. <laughs> this is so he bought it. Did you bring your book to read? I bought my book. Okay, that's good. Oh wow, there's like a little balcony up here too. Using this beautiful cotton fabric that I got from Napori Fabric Town. Have to match up the checks for it too, so and then I bought some thread, elastic, and yeah, that's all I need. So it is quite drapey, so I think that'll work really nicely on the bike. It's quite soft and drapey this cotton. DIY method. So the main reason for hiring this studio in Tokyo was for the experience. I was looking for a class to take or a workshop to attend but nothing quite aligned with my dates so I thought hiring a studio would be really fun and memorable.
I love that certain items of clothing hold such sentimental value and can transport you back to specific moments. And that's how I feel when I wear this skirt. I'm instantly transported back to this studio and our happy memories in Japan and even the challenge of working out how to print the pattern, getting lost in Tokyo, walking around. This garment was such a journey to create, which makes it all the more special. Thank you to the lovely Chi for allowing us to hire her studio space and special mention to Chris who never ended up reading his book but just ended up helping me film the entire time. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in Korea in my next video. Bye!